that politicians in Greece are voting on whether to legalise same-sex marriage. If the vote passes, it would make Greece the first country with a Christian Orthodox majority to do so. The bill was introduced by the country's centre-right Prime Minister, Kyriakos Mitsotakis, but about a third of his own MPs are expected to vote against it. That means he needs the support of politicians in the left-wing opposition for it to pass. Our correspondent Mark Lowen is following the story from Lisbon. He explained how significant this is for Greece. It's very significant in terms of being the first orthodox majority country, as you say, Rich, and also the first country in southeast Europe, uh, a, a region that is surrounded by countries that have not legalized same-sex marriage. The majority of the 15 EU members uh, which do allow it are grouped in the west and north of the European Union, so Greece would become an exception to that. Um, it is a country uh, where many still feel rooted in the country's tradition uh, and, and religion, and the powerful Orthodox Church has been fiercely against this um, and has been uh, has, has written a, ch a letter for prelates to read out in church services earlier this month in which they condemned the move. And that's reflected in, in, in views across society. So a recent poll found a very slim majority uh, in favour of the uh, same-sex marriage bill, about 55 per cent, or 50, between 53 and 55 per cent. Uh, but the Prime Minister feels that this is a time for Greece to uh, to, to, to catch up with many of its of its Western European neighbours and to and to pass a bill that would enshrine marriage equality and allow same-sex couples to adopt children. Uh, Mark, as you mentioned, this is uh, you know really teetering on the lines here when it comes to public support. Is the Greek Prime Minister gambling his political future on this? I don't think so, because he faces a pretty weak opposition at the moment. And the fact that he has felt confident enough to bring in this bill shows uh, how shows how stable he feels actually in power. He, he recently stormed to re-election a second term. And, uh, you know, what one might think actually that same sex marriage would be a would be a, a move that a left wing government or centre left government might might try to introduce. But here you have a centre right prime minister who feels that now is the time for Greece to, in effect, stand up to the Orthodox Church and, and, and pass this. And it is, a, it is a sign of his confidence that he feels ready to sort of tread on the turf of 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 a, of, a, of a political move that is more associated with the left wing and to, and to push it through. Uh, and, and that despite the fact that up to 50 MPs of his own 158 uh, MPs might rebel against him. He feels that he's got the support of, of opposition parties and it is likely to pass in a vote later on tonight. And we will follow that story here and bring you the latest on that vote when it happens around the world and across the UK. This is BBC News.